Yo, what's going on, everyone? Welcome to another episode of the Slope Podcast. Hey, you know what it is? It's your weekly podcast on the Sakamichi series Idol Groups. It's going to be Nogi Zaka 46, Sakura Zaka 46, Hinata Zaka 46, and Yoshimoto Zaka 46 is season four, episode six. This week, we talk about some uh, new Yoshimoto Zaka releases. Obviously, we got some fifth gens and Nogi Zaka, as well as some uh, Sakura Zaka single news. But before that, I'm one of your hosts. I'm Jimmy, a.k.a. Jimmy Tweets. I'm joined, as always, by my friends, my fellow hosts of Boy Boy Coon and Josh, Mr. Josh Box. Hello. How's it going, fellas? It's going okay, man. Yep, going God, all right. Okay. School is finally starting to oh, it's ramp up. up. Yeah. Yep. Ooh. Man, I thought I was going to get, like, an easy A for that one class with the professor that's MIA, but nah. You got a replacement professor, and you're like, oh, oh all so right, here's, here are your assignments. I'm like, no, oh, no, no, <laughs> <laughs> I gotta do work now. Oh, no, <laughs> at least it's not too terribly difficult. Mm-hmm. It's ethics, bro. <laughs> oh, man, uh-huh. but in like a, a you know, computer science mm-hmm. setting, I guess, yeah, like don't download illegal movies, stuff like that, right? Yeah, you know, that kind of stuff. Mm-hmm. Uh, anyway, yeah. Um, not nothing much, guys. Same shit. How are you, mm-hmm. Jimmy? You good? Still I, uh, sick? Yeah, I'm surviving though. Mm. <laughs> I, I I was telling uh, the guys this earlier. Like, just had a really bad reaction to whatever I had, and I just like completely puffed up and flamed up, whole body just swollen. Couldn't like. Move, could barely move my legs depending on what like position I could like hardly breathe couldn't really sleep right it was very shitty I like it, it was probably the worst experience of my life oh shit but it's that bad dude it was yeah you because know, it, it's like it's the point when it, like, it gets to like you you have like one possible sleeping position and then when the second you like move out of it you suddenly can't breathe, and then like you like jolt yourself awake, right? Because you're like, oh, fuck, I can't breathe. Mm. Um, and then you're just like, it's it just like it. It felt like it happened so quickly, like it went from me like going, being able to get up, like go about and like, you know, do things normally, even if I like don't, like even if I'm not leaving, like, like what is it? Uh, I just like, I'm like short of breath, just like trying to like go to the garage to do laundry. You know, mm. and I'm like, I'm like, dude, I used to be a fucking power lifter, you know? <laughs> but uh, but on, on the good note, uh, it is getting better. Uh, yeah, chat's asking if I've taken a COVID test again. I haven't, um, but I, I'm I'm working under the uh, like assumption that like I just got COVID and it just tested and like I just had a false negative or something. I because this yeah. was like just very abnormal. Right. Mm. Um because uh like but on yeah i i I didn't really see much point in like going to like a hospital or anything about it because it's just like what are they gonna do you know and like it's getting better so that's that's the thing um i as of like a couple nights like some of the most of the most of the swelling has gone down i still have like some in like certain parts of my legs and then that's about it like i can kind of like yes i have some of my like chest region but like I can move around in my bed and sleep fine now. Mm. So I think like that's that's a big thing. I think it compounds each other, right? It's like because you're not sleeping well, you're not being able, you're not able to recover, and mm-hmm. it just makes things worse. But then uh, lately, yeah, I've been able to like get some rest, and uh, things have been getting better. Um, I've like I still have a cough, but it's nowhere near as like bad as it was before. Like. Uh, you know, every now and then I'll like have a cough attack. I'll be like, okay, cool. But before it was just like every waking moment I'm coughing. Oh, no. oh man! <laughs> like I had this moment. It was so bad. I was like, uh, maybe, maybe it's just a, a little uh, graphic. But I was like on the toilet, and I was just like, <laughs> and, and like I was just like I was just thinking. I was like, oh, you know, what? I didn't have a, I haven't had like a, a visible symptom in a, in a few minutes now. I completely forgot that I was sick for a little bit, dude. And like that was that was very reassuring. Cause for a while there, you're just like, 
it's like constantly in your mind, you know, that you're mm-hmm. the fact that you're like super sick. But yeah. um, but yeah, feeling getting better. Still a little bit like out of it, a little exhausted, but we getting there. We getting there. Right on. Anything new, Josh? With you? I'm trying to think. <laughs> yeah, nothing think new. that hard. <laughs> no, no. Nothing new with me, but there's something new on the channel. There's a brand oh. new video out. Damn it, I was trying to stretch it out because I'm like still going to the page. <laughs> but hey, go on. <laughs> oh, okay, okay. Well, we have a brand new video. It's shorter news segments. So if you don't want to watch the whole podcast and you don't want as much detail and you don't want as much specific topics on Sakamichi, then we made a new... We're trying out a new series for you guys. It's... Big majority of idol news, so it can be from Nogizaka, Sakurazaka, you know, the whole Sakamichi. It can be AKB, it can be Hello Project, it could be indie idols, anything, anything that we put in there. And this one, we have five news topics we have AKB, we have two Nogizaka topics, we have a Beyond, and we have a I forgot the first one, Bish. So, if you're interested in any of those, or in, or just want to like get caught up with like the whole idol industry in general. I think that's a good way. And it's like super short. The, this first one was like oh, four minutes, a little over four minutes. So mm-hmm. it shouldn't take time at all. Yeah. If you want to check it out, please do so. Yeah, Leave a comment. Any fair. suggestions? Yeah. We're, we're trying to appeal to everybody here. The people that want to sit and listen to us talk and, and ramble on in detail about like the bokeh in the background of this photo like <laughs> yeah. photo book cover yeah <laughs> or the people that don't give a shit about that and just just tell me what's happening you know uh-huh. mm-hmm. so uh yeah let's see how long this lasts huh yeah, yeah. we'll see if, if people watch and they actually like comment a lot then that'll probably motivate us to like keep on going with the series yeah so uh anyway that's that's the channel update for the mm-hmm. week everyone mm-hmm but uh, there's a lot kind of going on in Sakamichi series this week. So let's talk about some Sakamichi series, y'all. Oh. First up, Yoshimoto Zaka. They, uh, oh, the lower thirds froze. Oh, uh, there you go. Uh, they are now in hibernation. Mm-hmm. So uh, their album was released last week. Uh, best album. Um, but they also released a music video for the lead track, Warata oh. Sayonara. Pretty simple, right? Um, a couple of members watching some clips uh, from the other members. And what do you guys think of the videos? I mean, the video is simple enough. Spectacular, but... There's not like real yeah. story. It's just like them. The, mo- the most that goes into story is like they walk in they see these mysterious videos playing on the TV. Then they get a mysterious invitation. Go to the <laughs> next door theater and watch a mysterious movie. Yeah. Kind of wholesome. Well, I feel like it's, but, you know. Yeah, it's it's cohesive, right? The idea is there. Like, the, the you know, like, music-wise, video-wise, it's nothing new, right? Mm-hmm. It's But it's all kind of banking on this kind of uh, general feeling of nostalgia, right? Which I think they, they pulled off very well, considering uh, they were a very short-lived group. Mm. to begin with and then you know it's not like they had a bunch of releases or anything right yeah. but like you know they, we still have some good memories right and they, they really capitalized on that mm-hmm, mm-hmm. um you know like the song itself makes me think of like a, a 60s like british rock folk kind of uh sound right like and then what is it uh the the, the music video itself kind of like you know like it's the graduation video with the, the nostalgia feels and stuff you yeah know? yeah so it's kind of nice, I guess. Uh, I wish it could have been more like a of a of like a bigger send off type video, you know, with every member getting a little bit of a uh, screen time. Yeah, that would have yeah, been nice, you know, and you know, all with our outfits or whatever. But it is what it is. We are in the COVID times. Mm, worst so, timeline. <laughs> <laughs> worst timeline. But um, they released another music video. Um, that's one of the newer tracks, uh, which I think is yeah on the album, um, called oh. AN No Gold Rush, which is uh, the second gens 
which uh, was a nice surprise to me because we finally get to see second gens do something uh, <laughs> yeah. perform their own song and like you know that was i think that was the biggest one of the biggest like uh like unfortunate things that happened with yoshimoto's album because mm. i felt mm-hmm. like second gens had a lot of potential um especially because they were hired for this a lot of them right yeah um yeah the the members who joined are like experienced in uh like dance performance or, or dance mm-hmm. yeah. theater performance you know that kind of stuff but we're into idol groups because we want to see the growth <laughs> i know <laughs> but um i'm also here for good production <laughs> but yeah here's uh do you have you guys watched the video for this no yeah i have okay well, me again. well let's let's do it again uh all right so the music video for the second gen song a and a gold we should have just skipped this one uh, Yoshimoto Zaka <laughs> never Ooh. disappoints, huh? Huh? Giving huh? us that uh, level of budget that is a bit too low, unfortunately. But I mean, I don't know, man. All right. So, for the people who got to enjoy the live recording, uh, Josh was a, was a bit harsh, a bit, just a tiny bit, um, a bit. <laughs> I don't know, man. I I I I will say, if if this was like a high school dance group's music video that they put together, and, right. and like you know, it was like a cover, like and that was a classmate like, oh, was a of very theirs. Cute... I'd be like, yo, yeah, yeah, right. yeah, that was a very cute gesture. All right, they really went in. Uh-huh. But the fact that it's yeah, it's it's like an actual music video from a, a professional label is like. Mm-hmm. I've, mm-hmm. I've seen many, many uh, underground Chica idols with like five fans have way better videos than this. Yeah, I no cap. Honestly, think we could have just spent the day and made a better video. <laughs> we video could have made a better video. 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 <laughs> oh man, the slope club, everybody. <laughs> <laughs> like, and that's that's no cap, dude. That was that was kind of rough, dude. <laughs> I think the um. One of the only like redeeming qualities of the video is are are the solo shots, um, like in the yeah. bridge. Yeah. Um, you know. I'm telling you, my assumption is they had a good camera. They had like a like a maybe like a DSLR or something, maybe like a mirrorless. They shot these solo shots, and then they're like, "Oh no, we out of batteries. They didn't bring the batteries. Anyone have a phone? The, it's always no. the batteries, dude." <laughs> here's here's my theory. They were like, "They're probably shooting on seventy two. All right, let's 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 get this nice. Well, let's go. Let's go rent this nice camera. That's our last video, all right? Before we go on hiatus, dude. Oh, let's get let's get a fucking red, dude. Ooh. Uh-huh. Okay, how much can we afford? Oh, an hour. Uh, you know what? You know what? it's fine. The music video, the song is only four minutes, five minutes. <laughs> we could do that in an it's hour. An hour. Dude. Come on. All right, let's yeah. do our and then uh, they spent, choreography shots. Our, oh, sorry, I fucked up. Can we like <laughs> run that back and they do it? No, no, the- no, you know, let's just let's just let's just do let's just do the the close up. Uh, lip sync part first, and then we'll we'll do the choreo. That that's part is easy. We'll get we'll knock that out faster. And then instead of doing just like little segments, they do the entire song for each person. Oh. And then they're like, "Ha, uh, Jikandis, uh, so it's been an hour. You gotta return the camera." Yeah. Like, <laughs> says, oh shit! He just did a Josh and forgot to press record. <laughs> <laughs> so then go back to the next thing. <laughs> oh man. All right, we got that right. Nice. <laughs> Pull out the memory card. They, they, no. There's nothing. In they, here. Mile, they Miles Morales the the fucking SD card. Dude. Oh man. <laughs> got him. Oh. Well, that's your yeah, Zaka. Uh, it's, it's a rough one. I'm gonna miss. It sucks because it's potential. There's potential. Like yeah, dude. Second gen would have been very interesting to see. Yeah, I feel like been, second uh, gen more polish, like, more budget. Yeah, really popular. Because they mm-hmm. got a lot of young members. You know, maybe when they return from their hibernation. Yeah, we'll see how many members are left. Yeah, from second gen, first gen, they'll probably also be there because they usually stay with the Mm. label for a long time. Mm -hmm. But um, yeah, so the album's on Spotify and all the other music streaming services for you to check out. But let's keep going. Um, There's not really he not the news this week. Mm-hmm. You know, the Zaka's just doing the usual, showing up on every TV show and radio show. You know how they are. Yeah. Let's go to you, Sakura Zaka, 46, who 
announce their fourth single, baby. Fourth single. Ooh. Out of nowhere. Out of nowhere. Fourth single is called... Uh, what is it? What's it called? Umidare yo. <laughs> Samidare yo. Yo. You got the teaser yo. with the visuals, you know? Mm-hmm. 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 Uh, April 6th is the release date and the lineup will be revealed on uh, Sokosaku coming this week. Um, as you know, uh, this will be Risa and Aoi's last single before graduating. So uh, it's Risa Center. Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> uh, but we got some details. Uh Pretty usual, right? Blu-ray, four limited types, and one regular. Yeah. Um, and uh, of course, we're we're still on the meet and greets, baby. Twenty twenty two, no physical contact made. So meet and greets. Uh, if you've done this, you know how it goes, right? Mm-hmm. Um, the first round of uh, meet and greets is actually tonight. Oh, so uh, oh, here are the dates uh, April 10th, 16th, 17th, 29th, and then May 7th and 8th for uh, meet and greet dates. Uh, of course, it's on Fortune Music. Um, as the sworn you know, enemy of the slope podcast, the, the uh, yeah, it's the, the enemy of the slope podcast. Um, so yeah, right. So it's going to be uh, on the same day every week, right? Um, when the slots go on sale. Mm. And then you apply for all the members you want and then uh, for a whole day, right? They'll get, you'll get your results uh, the day after. So your boy is going to have to apply for all the Risa. Uh, oh, it's coming to this. I believe in you, bro. It's coming I believe to in you, brother. Uh, let's go. I applied for 24 last time during nobody's fault. I won four. <laughs> the odds. Uh, well, this time it's going to be rough for you. I'm going to have to like double my efforts. We'll see. We'll I think see so. tonight. I think you'll get like one. Ah. <laughs> <sighs> I only get one. That's fine. I think you have to go. And all then I get board. rejected by staff son because you know. Oh no! <laughs> neither you card. No, we'll see. But um, yep. Mm-hmm. Well, it's okay. Now you know. You're just going for one member. You're not like spacing it out. You know, dividing yeah, your money. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. All Risa, baby. All in. All, all in. All Risa, dude. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Pray for me, chat. But um, anyway, let's talk about the single. There's not much yet, but who do you think is going to be uh, center? Let's talk about our, our formation. Who do you think is going to be? In this? Is it going to be Sakura 8? <laughs> or... I think they might, might still continue that. Yeah, I feel like I, I don't see any to... reason to abolish it right now. Okay. Yeah. Besides so the fact that I hate it, but yeah. Um... <laughs> I I don't I don't see them giving up on it anytime soon. Um, I would like to see more first gens involved because there's so many first gens graduating. Mm. Uh, right, because it's a uh, Aoi Chan as well, right? Yeah. Mm-hmm. You think they'll put Aoi in Sakura? 8? No. Damn. I I feel like they should. But they I should, mean, but are they? I, don't I mean, it's like, uh, eh, why not? Eh, why not? How many? Uh, uh-huh. How many first gens are left? Are there yeah. eight. I mean, it's literally like okay. <laughs> okay so Risa, Risa, and fucking Aoi. You can literally fill the other six with literally anybody. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like, like at, I mean, at least tossing her a Sakura eight is not that hard, dude. They've they've been kind of. Um, Slowly doing that, right? Like Karin was in the first two, mm. and then she wasn't in third mm. single, right? So mm. the Koike, so last single, uh, Berika was a Sakura eight, but you know she graduated, so there's a oh, that's there, true, that's true, right? that's true, yeah. So so it's like they can, yeah, they easily can still keep 
their precious, you know, second gen <laughs> elite squad in and still have a little room for Aoi Chan, dude. Come on. Mm. Ah, Chapping's a good point. Nen wasn't in Sakura 8. Well, she, sorry, she probably sold a little I more. Guess not. <laughs> yeah, dude. Josh won't let it happen, Aoi. I'm sorry. It's already yeah. in the car. <laughs> so I think for sure, right? Like Pawn. Oh, well, yeah, yeah. I think, yeah. Uh, Risa. Uh, I like Tenchan, Hono. Hmm. And, and, yeah. Rune. And now, wait, let's go. <laughs> That's already, yeah, Rune. How many days Rune, Rune probably there. I don't know. <laughs> like that was like seven. Look? I don't know. Something like that. See, hopefully, they switch it up. Um, I mean, we always say that. And they only did a, I know. they only done it with the standards a couple of times. The thing, but like, there's in this general, their, they don't really change it up. Their fourth single, so I, I want to see them switch it up. Like, I don't expect anything drastic so to happen. Young, yeah, yeah, yeah. But who, who do you guys want to see? Like, if they're doing Sakura, they're gonna do this, the three centers thing, right, with the coupling tracks, right. Do you think Hono is going to center a song again? Mm. Or is it going to be somebody new like Rena? Let's go, man. <laughs> <laughs> Rena, anybody? Oh, no, oh. Jimmy's gone. Oh, Jimmy's, uh, gone. Jimmy's like, Rena, no, I'm leaving. <laughs> Rena, I don't think so. <laughs> <laughs> but, um, wait, what, what happened, Jimmy? Hello? <laughs> what happened? I, I can hear you, Jimmy. Oh, there we go. Oh, your volume's like really low. Hold on. I gotta fix Jimmy's camera. This is on full copium right now. I feel like this is like half the time always on copium. <laughs> you know, life support over here. <laughs> Just addicted to copium at this point. Whatever, whatever keeps you afloat, my guy. Why is Jimmy so low? What happened to his volume? Hello, hello. Uh, let me check my. Maybe I did the wrong. It thing. sounds fine to me. Not to me, baby. <laughs> is Jimmy frozen or is he staring? At, intensely staring. <laughs> I think I'm intensely staring. Oh, Lama says he sounds fine. Uh, I'm just gonna. Is he just like on your earphones? All right, let's see. Is this? Can you see? Hello. Something? Nope, that didn't work. Hello. I don't know. He's like really low to me. I can barely hear him. Oh really? Chat says he sounds fine. So maybe it's something. Well, chat. Whatever's going through his Hello. His, his uh, audio is directly directly there. Going to um. Mm. See this. Should I rejoin? Uh, that's it. Should be okay now. Okay. Anyway, where were we? Our guesses. Uh -huh. Yeah, for the 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 three centers or whatever. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I'd like to see Pone now that she's back. Oh yeah, yeah. All right. All that Thanks, hype. Yeah. You see some of the the video of her and uh, Fuyuka doing Jamaican beer, dude. Where's that I'm from? Like, I just like started seeing Twitter posts about it. No clue, actually. I just like yeah, I just stream. Yeah. Oh, maybe. Showroom? Showroom. Okay. Showroom. Oh, okay. Chaz is pawn double center with Risa. No, that is the one thing I don't want. <laughs> like, well, you don't either, want to share either Risa center, spotlight? <laughs> either Risa center or pawn center, not both. Uh -huh. Okay, so if everyone was a, was, a, was a betting man and they were to put their money all in on one person to be the center, who is it? Risa. Oh, mine will go to Pon. That's a fair choice, also. Yeah. Because they haven't done like a graduation say, center thing yet. They haven't, but it's 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 also Risa. It's like one of their centers graduating. That's true. You know? That's true. Yep. Um, will Rune Chan I feel like if, center if catchy oh, song for the fourth single for the fourth oh. time? I see it. Okay. 
Hmm. We're gonna see Honos come oh, back in center. Again. Let's get a, a Habu track. Habu center over here. That's what we want. Oh, Habu. Oh. It's like a really cool song, yeah. you know. Habu in the front center, true center Uemu. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Got him with the formation yet again. <laughs> That's the only way. That's the only way it's possible. <laughs> All right. Here's my hopeful. If they do the same, you know, main track and two couplings with the centers, right? Like Risa will will center fourth single, and then the other two, Hono and Rena. Let's go. Ooh. <laughs> Let's go. Have we heard Rena like sing that much? She centered in Backslide, so yeah. We, mm, okay, okay. Yeah, I you're think right. we've had I it I, I mean, it's not like Sakura Zaka is a very vocal. Yeah, that's true. That's true. They're more group, of the uh, you know, performance, performance. Uh, mm. type of. Uh, yeah. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. She, hasn't, she hasn't been in uh, Sakura 8 yet, right? Oh, she has. For the last two singles. Oh, okay. Well, no, not okay. 8. Sorry. She was in the main lineup, not the Sakura 8. Yeah, yeah. She was in the main mm-hmm. lineup, but wasn't in the Eito. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I like to I like to see her hit get the eight tone and give him like a really cute song, you know. Oh yeah, yeah. I can see that. Oh, <laughs> I just see the stonks go up. Come on, <laughs> yeah, get her center, give her a cute song, and we will let Uemu join, dude. Oh. Yeah, I mean she's been in a lot a lot of TV. Let's just put all the short ones, you know, in the front. Ooh, in the old subunit. Okay, Ooh, Rune Rune Rena, dude. Yeah. Uh-huh. There we go. I wouldn't mind seeing that center uh, configuration. <laughs> yeah, dude. Oh, look at them short ones. Mm-hmm. And they just make Habu in there, too. <laughs> so it's and just Habu's like... in the back. just towers over. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> they can recreate the uh, the Kimini Shikarareta one with the, with the uh, symmetrical one, but Habu is like standing tall. <laughs> <over>. <laughs> Um, can, Abu can be the tree in Futari Saison, dude. Oh, oh. Okay, when they go like this, <laughs> yeah, they're all just getting, covered, getting covered up. So they're just like, she's just standing there, just looking down, just like they're just touching her shoulders, <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> uh, but yeah, the Senbats will be revealed on Sokusaku this weekend, so it's probably gonna be like the thing tagged at the end, right? Like, by the way, fourth single, here's the oh, lineup, yeah, yeah, yeah. so. God, please let it just be a straight announcement of Senbatsu. I don't want... I, we've gathered all the members they into a room. So I think it's fine. Yeah. They just show, like, the graphics, right? Even mm. though Kizaka doesn't do that anymore. Mm. Yeah, they just, like, they just, like, have the little interview, right? Yeah. Oh, so yeah. you were, uh... You did the second grade, yeah, they, I guess they still you do the, the thing, but it's not yeah. shown. Yeah. No, that that's much better than the... Mm. The fucking room, dude. I fucking hated that, dude. And then they're like... <laughs> it's like they're in court, dude. Yeah, <laughs> yeah right. <laughs> It'd be interesting if, like, instead of, like, telling them in a room like that, like, they just walked up to the camera. Oh, hey, you're in the... You're in the Senbatsu. What do you oh, think? Oh, dude, that'd be oh, so much better. <laughs> right? They just, like, roll up and say, hey, you're the yeah. center for the next single. Yeah. <laughs> what? A oh, word? <laughs> I feel like that'd be <laughs> ten times better. <laughs> Um, I feel like they should do that with Hinata because everyone's in the, in the oh, lineup. Uh huh. Right? Uh-huh. Like, mm, all the members uh-huh. are in, so I'd like there won't be anyone left out, kind of thing. Mm-hmm. But, um, did yeah. you hear about the front row? You're not in it. <laughs> what? Oh, got him. <laughs> <laughs> um, but, let's make the center yeah. run around with the camera telling everyone they're not center. <laughs> uh, yeah, so fourth single didn't see that coming. So soon, mm-hmm. but I guess that's fine. Risa won't leave until May at least, so I'm cool with it. Um, let's go to Nogi. What's happening with Nogi Zaka this week? Guys. Uh. More grads. Okay. <laughs> I was like, I'm going to throw it to one of them. Anyway, uh, Shinichi Mai. Exasperated and- sighs across the room. Oh. Uh. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, Shinuchimai and Hoshino Minami's uh, graduation ceremonies will be streamed. Y'all can buy these streaming tickets through the usual streaming 
yeah. services. About thirty dollar stage crowd rock and abema and all that fun stuff. Yep. This it's this week, right? Huh? Yeah. It'll be mm-hmm. technically yeah. tomorrow, right? When is it? So my tunes is on the tenth, and then Hoshimina on the twelfth. So yeah, tomorrow for us out here uh in West Coast. Mm-hmm. Yeah, dude. Time. Living in the past, dude. Mm-hmm. Um, so yeah. I wonder what how it's gonna be. It's not like gonna be a full blown concert. It's just well, yeah, it's just it's ceremony. Happen. So, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. so, um, there's also goods for oh. both. We can check out real quick. Um, there's uh, what is this? I, I guess it's. Oh wait, well, the first one is my tunes, right? Mm-hmm. Got a long tee, short sleeve. What about tea. them socks? Oh though. yeah. Oh. Right, you got the purple tag on the white sock. Yeah, dude. Oh, yeah. Oh yeah. Oh, I like these stickers. You know. Mm-hmm. The Mai Mai oh. and then the little dog and the, mm-hmm. her with the headphones. Yeah, it's from the music. Her it's music video, reason, right? Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah. yeah. They released the full music video. It's on the Nogi channel. Um, and then you also get. Plates? What is this? Oh, clear files and key holders. Oh, damn. I thought they were plates, dude. Damn, dude. You're going to be eating my pasta on top <laughs> yeah, of Shinichi Mai, dude. <laughs> right, we got all the members so you can get. And then um, uh, photo sets. Mm-hmm. Just like the usual stuff. Yeah. But they're wearing the uh, My Chun and Hoshimena grad ceremony t shirt. Okay. Not bad. Pretty usual uh, Nogi design goods, I guess. Yeah, yeah. Anyone want to cop those socks for us? Yeah, get us some socks, dude. Please? I mean, like, we ask every time, dude. No one offers. <laughs> like, we'll pay, dude. I keep asking because I feel... Hey, we damn. just sit here with, with, with our with our fingers crossed, you know, just... Right. Twiddling our <laughs> thumbs. I lay Anyone? A, a, Anyone? A, in my bed awake at night, I'm like, I wonder when someone will offer to buy us. <laughs> so, <laughs> someone message? <laughs> Not yet. And then I fall asleep crying because yeah. no one ever does. <laughs> Meanwhile, viewers sounds like, Haha, these guys are so silly with their jokes. <laughs> their joke, no, asking for socks <laughs> joke. Please. Ah, uh, well, that's that. Let's keep going to more Nogi news. Um, Asuka is featured again on a Mondo Grosso track. Mm-hmm. Ooh. The video is released. The album is out. Uh, Mondo Grosso's new album is called Big World. It's uh, his first album in like three years, I think. First full one. Um, and, and the last album, he had Asuka on another track called mm-hmm. Wakse Tantura. So this one's called Stranger, um, which is a pretty nice shoegaze track, which uh, kind of fits like her vocal style. Uh, it's very like mm-hmm. airy and ethereal, but you know it's like oh. this wall of noise, right, with the guitar. So it just like mm-hmm. washes over. But, uh, yeah, I'm digging it. I've been uh, pretty hyped for this album uh, since they announced it. Feels like mm-hmm. I can see in like the the soundtrack of like, a a two thousands coming of age movie, dude. Oh, you yeah, know, yeah, yeah. The, and it's um, like we like the the ending where there's no real resolution, dude, mm-hmm. and then like. The credits kind of start rolling, and I just have to fill in the uh, gap. Just one of the characters, like halfway out a car window, and just like, you know, <laughs> yeah, cars, like rolling down the the highway or whatever. Mm-hmm. That kind of scene. I don't yeah, know. yeah, they definitely like on a road trip across like the like the Midwest somewhere. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, dude. Um, yeah, the video has like these two. Uh, kind of settings right where there's one where she's like in the hotel room and then mm-hmm. there's another kind of like the more performance part i guess with all the flowers and she has a mic yeah. and i like the shots the colors are really interesting on there like right, the greens and yellows greens we got a feet shot for jimmy all right so <laughs> oh thank you ask got everything 
this video. <laughs> but um, yeah, the uh, album's out if you want to listen to it. We were playing a little bit of it uh, during the pre-show today, so it's on Spotify and everything. It's nice. It's a uh, it's a very different like, not just like obviously different sound for, her, but different look too, right? Because I think yeah. normally like Nogi Zako mm-hmm. and they do their hair and makeup, it's meant to make them look a little bit more innocent, young looking. Uh, whereas like she looks much more mature here. Mm-hmm. Uh, mm-hmm. Really like this look on her, you know. Yeah. It's cool. Yeah. Like they yeah. kind of feel went... like it's a little bit closer to like. Oh, good. I was going to say they they went back to the the kind of the similar look she had on their first collaboration. Yeah. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Hoxie Tantra. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I feel like this is like more akin to like how Asuka like normally dresses. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Yeah. So enjoy it. Cool. Let's keep going. Uh, Nogi 29 single also doing meet and greets. Everyone. It also oh. comes out earlier than the Sakurazaka single. It comes out March 23rd. That is what, like two weeks before the Sakurazaka one. So they're not too, like, not uh that far apart mm. um, but yeah meet and no greets. rest meet and greets are gonna keep going everybody uh here are the dates april 17th april 30th may 22nd june 5th and then july 3rd and seventh. damn why is it all spread out what happened that's kind of interesting but okay um mm. I mean, he's like, we're busy, May. We only have one day. We're busy. <laughs> so, yeah, it's going to be on Fortune Music also, but I don't know when this, the rounds start. Um, so, it might be tonight. I don't know. We got our participating members. Um, everyone minus the popular first gens who have served. It says first... First application February 9th, February 10th. Oh, okay. Is so today. it is tonight, just like the Sakurazaka <laughs> one. Rip. Um, but yeah, everyone who usually participates will participate. No fifth mm-hmm. gen, guys. So if oh. y'all were like, whoever, whoever, oh, yeah, for all the big Not fifth today. gen stands, dude. Not yet. I really guys. imagine that being great. Yes. I really liked your three second YouTube video. <laughs> I like looking at you hold those flowers. <laughs> this is like, like the way you, you held those flowers. Yeah. I'm also it's so from better Chiba. than my past yeah. Shimin that I saw for years. <laughs> <laughs> I am also from Chiba. <laughs> so, um, oh, there's more info here. So, Ki Chan, who's graduating, not participating, of course. Manatsu and Asuka, uh, they, uh, you know, they've served their time, so they mm-hmm. don't do this shit no more. Yoda's gonna be absent for a couple days. Tetsui is not participating April 30th. Um, oh she Kitagawa, you're not doing it at all? What? Oh what? Okay, so they're they're gonna see if uh, you know, depending on her classes, you know. Mm. But uh anyway, like the rest are just have scheduled conflicts and stuff. So mm-hmm. It is what it is, everybody. Anyway, I'm not buying these tickets. <laughs> <laughs> Anyone participate? Anyone still doing Nogi uh, meet and greets? Huh? Uh, Chat, how, how, how'd it go? Yeah. The only thing I I I would do is just speak English with the the American girls, you know. So Ray, right now. <laughs> Yo, what's good? What's up? Maybe oh, no Japanese here. Okay. Oh, hey. Clam chowder, am I right? Uh, yeah. Ooh, housing market. Hey, you, you totally called that dude, that comedian, a bitch in that video, didn't you? <laughs> oh, yeah. Uh, you potty mouth. Um, Kiss your mama with that mouth, Rick. <laughs> um, let's go to the last thing. Fifth gens, everybody. They have announced all the members... Uh, who are going to be announced. Um, we have eight of them. Mm-hmm. Right, The last three will be announced in March sometime after they are uh, done with their academic stuff. Um, but they will have an event on the tw- 23rd, right? Yeah. Mm-hmm. So uh, what 
look out for that. Mm-hmm. Anyway, um, out of all of the, no, I think they'll, they'll also be on. Uh, are they also going to be on Forty Six Hour TV? Forty Six Hour. Uh, the event is on the same day as the last day of Forty Six. Oh, so probably. So it might like tie in. I don't know. Yeah. Um, but uh, yeah, we got we got uh, we got their names and everything. The last girl hasn't been updated yet, but uh, her video has been released mm-hmm. on the Nogichu channel. So, um, were you guys keeping up? Who did you did you uh, did anyone uh, strike your fancy? And like, oh man, this girl might be the one. I oh, she had two. <laughs> oh, the way they hold the flowers, dude. I, I you know what? No, nah, I just I'm gonna stick with uh, Inoue. I just oh. you know I've known her the longest out of all. <laughs> We've known we've known her the longest. We've known uh, her the longest, dude. It's kind of kind of fucked up. Y'all just bandwagoning to right? all these other girls. Dude. <laughs> I no, mean, they've all done the so same hard. thing <laughs> after the Loyalty. first day. Messed up. I know, trifling, dude. This right. is this is what I've been trying to say about idol fandom, dude. Y'all trifling. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Bunch of trifling ass <laughs> fans. Mm. But um, there's an uh, an abundant number of members from Chiba. Like, mm-hmm. what's happened? Uh, you know, people are making jokes. Oh, Chibuzako. <laughs> but uh, I think the girl that was announced on the third day to the girl who was announced like the seventh day or something like that. There's like a five in a row from Chiba. Mm-hmm. And so, um, yeah, a, a lot of members, five out of the initial eight are from Chiba. <laughs> what happened? <laughs> um that must that must be in one of the centers for for the actual participant. Maybe that was like round three, and people like oh, I don't want to go with Chiba. <laughs> All the Chiba girls like yeah, we're here. All right, it's like ah, I don't want to travel. You know, travel. Maybe COVID messed up like the 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 yeah. Fukuoka I could, legend I could see that. who is gonna I can see that know, gonna be the, mm-hmm. the a reincarnation, not reincarnation, <laughs> like the second <laughs> coming of reincarnation. Uh, uh, Hashimoto Kanda, you know. <laughs> <laughs> But yeah, it's a surprising amount of uh, members from Chiba. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Um, and apparently, a lot of them uh, are already uh, experienced in in some way, not just like some, you know, hometown local girl, right? Uh, that came to do a Nogi audition. They like. Some of them have done modeling or like appeared in commercials in the past and stuff like that. Mm-hmm. So, um, yeah, like on Twitter, like right after, that? right after the, their videos came out, all the the degenerate fans already found like their past social media and like all the photos <laughs> they were in before. <laughs> oh man, that is the way of the idol fan, bro. There's the one Disgusting. girl in particular. Uh, it was the oh, one from yesterday, right? Yeah, the short hair one. Uh, uh-huh. She's done a lot of like I don't know, a lot of modeling mm-hmm. work, right? Yeah, so there's a, like a lot of pictures of her already uh, that mm-hmm. that were released from stuff she's done before. Uh, she, yeah, she'd been an active in in some capacity, right? Yeah. So if you, if you just like go the hashtag her name on Twitter, there's like a bunch of pictures that's not like Nogizaka related, right? Like mm-hmm. Modeling, mm-hmm. they look very uh, you know, like a Gravia young jump type of style, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah, it does. Mm-hmm. Um, so, and then there was this the one member who was like a child actor or something, and she had like a pretty extensive list of of. Uh, oh, that was, that was either work. the second one or. Something like that. Yeah. Um, so. I mean, I wouldn't put it past those members because, like, if they want to be, like, in the entertainment industry, you know? Right. The idols stuff. I mean, the, I, could, the goal... I could say, like, maybe some of them had YouTube channels, you know? True. And just, like, had to delete it. I think it's, it's more common now, right? With, like, fans. Yeah. Who, who be, you know, like, Kubo mm-hmm. is the a Ease fan. of access Yak- now. Yakubo is a fan. She became a member. Um, yeah, yeah. Right? Like, and then there are some who, who are already active as uh in in entertainment and became out right the mm. goat oshima yuko was a child actor that's true that's true yeah yeah 
Um, so. And it's not like, you know, Nogizaka is some no-name group they're joining, dude, yeah. you know? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> I mean, even if they look back to, like, first gen, like, Himetan used to be, like, in different idol groups beforehand. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah. Etomisa was a gravy idol. Like, actual, uh-huh. you know, bikinis and shit all the time. Uh-huh. Shit. Yeah, like a you know, DVD release mm-hmm. and everything. Yeah, shit. yeah, yeah should have a photo book before. Yeah, uh-huh. I think it's uh, it's getting a lot of talk now because it's so concentrated uh, on yeah. one generation. Um, so, mm-hmm. Yeah, uh, but I guess it's it's cool. I mean, I can see how people are saying, you know, it's kind of like ah, I prefer to see like a, a nobody, right? Kind of come up mm-hmm. and be an idol because that's mm-hmm. what it's all about, bruh. Um, but this is also fine. Yes. Yeah, I feel like it. It usually barely ever plays into anything, mm-hmm. so that's why I'm like, yeah, whatever about it. You know what I mean? Yeah. yeah like, are you gonna say like Eto Misa is less of an idol than like Ozuna Momoko? You know, like. Yeah, it's not too big of a deal to me. Yeah, it's um, more. It's more about what they do with it, right? Yeah. Um, mm-hmm. but it's it's kind of interesting to see. Like, oh, look, this girl was a you know, this girl's an American. Hmm. <laughs> 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 So uh, yeah, Did you, any any initial uh, the favorites for you guys? Dude, it's uh, too early. Too Inoue early. Nagi, dude, what's oh, wrong with you? Right. Guys? Sticking with the, I like oh, the second girl. Uh, oh, so, Ichinose. Ichinose, like smile, Miku? Mm, so good, dude. Oh, her mm. smile, so good, bro. But uh, also, she's one of the older ones. So I'm just like, yeah, she's please, please announce a 20 year old. But apparently, she's like two 18 year olds, right? Yeah. She's one of the two. Yeah, it's her girls. and uh, Nishikawa. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Uh, Nishi Naka. Naka Nishi, I don't know. Sorry. Naka Nishi. Uh, I'm like, yeah. Can't read right now, dude. <laughs> Leave but, me alone. I have COVID probably. <laughs> but see, Fukuoka. See, uh, Ichinose Miku is from Fukuoka and like, for for a while, Fukuoka was like the hotbed of idol uh, oh. culture, right? You had like a big mm-hmm. bunch of like big names pop up from Fukuoka. Uh, but yeah, I like her smile, bro. Also, she's old, mm. but apparently she's she's at the top of the age range for this generation. Damn it! So young. Where are the grandmas? Where's my Yumiki now of fifth grade? Yeah, dude. Mm hmm. <sighs> well, anyway. So, so, I like this. These... Is, I was on Twitter. This is an article where they measured the head of a member. <laughs> they stacked it up. She's like, she's rumored to be 174 <laughs> centimeters tall. <laughs> Y'all too much. <laughs> Y'all too much, man. The degeneracy, dude. That's funny. What, what was the meme where someone did that to like to a YouTuber or some shit? Wasn't that oh, like, was a Twitch thing streamer? Oh, yeah, it was yeah. a Twitch streamer. They, they compared it. They compared him to like the keyboard. <laughs> yeah, and then they yeah. compared the keyboard to the door. <laughs> <Something like that. laughs> they figured out how tall the guy was or something. Yeah. <laughs> uh, but uh, yeah, I'm I'm gonna, I'm gonna go with the two 18 year olds because one nice smile, the other one short hair. Let's go. Oh, okay. No, oh. he's the only one with short hair. Right, the, out of all the all the ones they they announced so far, so yeah, this is like we will see, man. Um, goddamn, this fucking Tui. <laughs> so uh, one seventy four. What she's like the tallest <laughs> one ever to be in Nogizaka. We <laughs> be towering over Umazawa. <laughs> what the heck? All right, we'll see when she shows up uh, uh-huh. on TV and, and stuff. <laughs> or I guess we'll see him at uh, 46 Hour TV or something. Mm-hmm. But damn. Okay. <laughs> Dude, we're recording my calculations. <laughs> mm. <laughs> well, there you go. Fifth gen. Um, we got the initial uh, announcements. Uh, the next thing is... Uh, 46 hour TV. Yeah, yeah. Yep. And uh yeah, that's it's gonna be it for the uh current events this week. Uh we'll come back after a quick break with the TV show highlights. And we're back. 
time for the TV show highlights, where we uh, highlight some TV shows that we watched over the week that featured uh, our favorite Sakamichi series idols. There are the three shows that we mainly watch, or try to at least. Hinata Zaka, De Aima Show, where this week they continue the Kaska, Kaske competitions. Um, there's also Sokomagatara Sakuzaka, where it was a Valentine's Denso, Danso, Denso, Danso Moso, everyone. Mm. Oh, bless, dude. Um, and then Nogizaka Kojichu, also Valentine's, but it's time for the chocolate. Mm. These are always fun to watch because you get to laugh at senpai who think they'll get chosen for chocolate, but they never I do. I've been, I've been, I've been hanging out with these members more lately. You know, <laughs> it's just like it's pretty fun. <laughs> right? But um, yeah, uh, let's 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 do some highlights, everyone. All right. Oh, I'm first. Damn. Okay. My highlight is from <laughs> Soko Magatara. Sakurazaka, and in this episode, they did uh, Moso uh, situations, like their ideal uh, situations. Confessions, right? Yeah. Yeah, a confession from, like, the person they like. And so there's there's a few members who did Danso, looking all handsome. Look at uh, Yumio Kun over here. It was only Seki, mm -hmm. uh, Habu, and um, Inoue, right, that did the yeah, yeah, because Seki went twice, I think. Yeah. So it yeah. was on the second skit with Seki, and it was Onuma's his situation. And then it was, like, at a uh, rope bridge where they, they're, like, in high school or whatever, and they, this is the way home that right? they always take. And then, um, you know, they start messing around and, like, shaking the bridge and, like, oh, wait, stop shaking the bridge, please. Dude, I felt that, dude. I'm afraid of heights, so I was like, hmm. I'm with you, Yumi Okun, dude. Yeah, and mm -hmm. so, like, Onuma uh, gets all excited, and so, like, she starts jumping on the bridge, and it shakes harder, and then Yumi Okun was like, I love you to save his own life. <laughs> <laughs> That's my highlight. She's the like, confession. what? <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna die. I'll say it now. Yeah, like, I love you to say this before I go, brother. I love you. <laughs> So she stopped. And that's the only reason. Yumi <laughs> Okun is still alive, dude. <laughs> so, yeah, that's my highlight. Uh, <clears throat> Mine's actually from the same episode. Mm. And it's, uh, it's a little bit meta because it's not so much about the, the, the Moso itself as much as it is like about the, the reaction to it, right? It's like, so it's from the, the Habu Kun and, uh, this is from Ozono Reis, mm -hmm. right? And she's like, they're like office workers, right? And he's, Habukun's like the senpai. They gotta like stay at work late or whatever. Uh, and it's just like, as soon as they pan up to reveal Habukun's face, all the members are just fucking thirsting, dude. They're just like, <laughs> oh. Oh my dang, God. Bro. That desert. <laughs> yeah, dude. I was like, stop looking at Habu with such lewd eyes, you filthy <laughs> idol. <laughs> <laughs> I like the like the cameraman even like starts like down. Shoots yeah, he starts down. He pans up. Yeah, like freaking like Koike's face, dude. Oh my god, he's just like. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> Though I will say, I was like, Yo, uh, Abu Kun, what up? <laughs> what up, brother? <laughs> Damn, bro, looking handsome, bro. <laughs> yeah, dude. Um, yeah, that that was my highlight. I was just like, dude, look at. Oh my god, this is, Habu's got them all wrapped around her fingers, dude. Just <laughs> throw on that wig, it's GG, dude. Uh -huh. the, the, the actual Moso is like stupid as hell, right? They're like, yeah. oh, they, they stay late, and then Ozono's like, oh, thank you so much, you know, like, we got some work done. And he's like, oh, here's some candy, dude. She's like, oh, it's a, like, like, is there anything you want? Anything? He's like, oh, can I ask for anything? Yeah, anything you want. Marry me. <laughs> Even though this is the first time we've ever talked, everyone's yeah. like, "What?" Marry me? <laughs> yeah, like, what the fuck? <laughs> what happened to this scenario? <laughs> they lost all of their doki points that they like. Yeah. They would have. They probably would have instantly won just mm. purely based on Habu Kun right. if it wasn't for the stupid scenario. The swerve ending. Why did mm. it have to end 
this way, dude. Mm. But yeah, they uh, the the rest of the members voted on if if the uh, scenario was kun kun or not kun. The Habu one definitely not not kun. Um, I think the f- only the first scenario got all kuns, right? Yeah, yeah the first one got all with uh, Rune Rune and and um. Uh, Inoue. Inoue. Mm-hmm. With the... Had that Kabedon maneuver. Like, oh, mm-hmm. all right. Mm-hmm. Um, the classic. Uh, yeah, it's pretty uh, classic. Shoujo manga mm-hmm. scenario right there. Um, yeah. That's uh, that's our highlight there, Josh. Mine is from Noichu. And it's mm-hmm. all the debates that happened. Ooh. Oh. Got him. Sag. The first half Sag, was a little dude. first half was a little slow because it was just like explaining everyone. Mm. But then they do it later anyway. So like when they're up there, they ask like, "Oh, why do you think?" So I feel like the first part really wasn't. I don't learn anything. The first new. part because it oh. shows that how much they were scheming. This was not like <laughs> yeah. This wasn't like you know truly. Uh, Right, they planned for this, right? Yeah, That's it, was why. On, it wasn't honorable, dude. They were like, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I've been trying to hang out with this member because, right? <laughs> you fucking filthy senpais, dude. But right? this, like, this oh, I'll mention some of it later, you know. <laughs> senpai dirty, dude. Yeah. <laughs> like, uh, like, uh, Hoshino, he was like, well, I said good morning to her today. <laughs> <laughs> and they're like, that's, that's your. <laughs> But then also later, Hoshino actually got a Valentine. <laughs> it's funny because yeah. when they touched her hand, she's like, "Oh, what was touching me?" <laughs> so he actually voted for me. <laughs> yeah, it was uh, Kakehashi, right? Kakehashi picked her. Yeah, yeah, because mm-hmm. mm-hmm. they got yeah. uh, pretty close, right? She lets me call her Minami Chan or whatever. Mm-hmm. Right? So, um, yeah. I always enjoy these Valentine's things. This is just to see everyone get debated. It was like, I like, guess like the, the ones who didn't get chosen. All right, please go back to your seats. Yeah. <laughs> just like, <laughs> just like oh, so far, Oscar hasn't got chosen. So we'll see how far this goes. Embarrassing. You think? Do you think they, they said that they do it this way so you don't feel as bad as before, dude? When it's like, uh, like more members oh, go dude, up. Yeah, they're they're pure. These pure maidens getting their heart crushed, dude. Yeah, if it's, it's just, just like, if it's just two. Then like you feel bad for the other person, but if it's like a lot of them, then, like oh, okay, they all gotta yeah, go back yeah. together. Yeah, yeah. Because yeah. they all campaigned this time, right? Like mm-hmm. Higuchi mm-hmm. bought them all like Mikan and shit. Like, <laughs> but then what about they asked, the? Yeah. You remember the Mikan? And they're like, what? what? Mikan? Like, what? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> what? <laughs> Fucking Ash. Yeah, I got them sweets, dude. From Ash. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> like, like, oh, Asuka Kara. Uh-huh. Yeah. Um, we'll see uh, the rest next week. Mm-hmm. And Chad is asking about Hina Ai. Uh, they did Oscar. too much brain games. They should have done more re- more sports you... games. Yeah, they did like the the the, the dummy toss thing. Mm-hmm. Um, mm-hmm. Yeah, the, the moment I saw Sai- I saw Saito Kyoko be up in a in a competition that's supposed to emulate Sasuke. I knew I wasn't going to talk about it on the show. <laughs> yeah. Jesus. I, um, I, I watched the first part. And then once they, they got in their seats, I skimmed through the rest. <laughs> I, I think that's fair. <laughs> I was like, no. <laughs> oh, no. Because that's all they fucking do, dude. They try to one-up each other and like, right? And, and they, they go for the jokes all the mm. time. Oh, the eating was good. You're well, right. They've been bentos. That was kind of cool. Yeah, that was cool. And then like like four of them just like have 7-Eleven like just yeah. boxes. The chicken thing. Like, uh, what the hell? Just All right. like chicken nuggets. Yeah. But uh, yeah, that's that's he and I, y'all, this week. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Um, a quick shout out to Hamaska Hosobu. Uh, I'm really liking their chemistry now. <laughs> oh, <okay>. just Hama <laughs> and, and, and Asuka is just like he he would say stuff and like when he like fumbles his words like on the rare occasion she would just like laugh, <laughs> and then like you know, that that whole programming uh bara bara daisaksen or whatever, like Hamaska Hosobu got the award for like best show or something, 
Uh-huh. So they are uh, increasing the broadcast for the show from 15 oh. to 30 minutes. Let's go. Come okay. up. Let's go. Okay. Come up. Let's do this shit. Because yeah, I didn't think I'd like this show so much, but for some reason I just do. We just talk about random like musical stuff. And, like this week, they got uh, they were talking about like uh, train chimes or whatever. Uh, you know, like at the subway when you're when the train comes and it plays a little like, jingle or whatever. Mm-hmm. And um, last week's episode, Hama taught Asuka to play bass. Oh yeah, which was kind of cool. So uh, yeah, that's the highlights this week. Hey, you know what that means? I mean, that's it for this week's episode. Mm-hmm. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you haven't already, make sure you hit that subscribe button. If you're watching on YouTube, drop a comment down below. Let us know what you thought about uh, the, the 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 variety shows this week, or maybe some of the fifth gen members. Who were some of your favorites? Your standout? Why was it Ino Inagi? Because you're not trifling like the rest <laughs> of this idol fandom, right? Uh, but that's going to be great from us this week. Uh, you know, uh, as always, you stay up to date with us throughout the socials. Come give us a follow over at twitch.tv slash club. Hang out with us every Tuesdays around 7 p.m. Pacific time while we do the live show. And then, uh, yeah, we'll see you guys next time. Bye. Bye. Bye.